Hi, welcome to the next um, video. I don't think so. That's my mask. Cut, cut, cut. Hi folks and welcome back to the next video and we've got a special guest here is my son. Oh, hi. Wait a minute. Who are you? AKA the fish boy. <laughs> and he's brought two mantises and he wants me to do a video on them. So these are going to be care needs for a new mantis that I have had before but I've not covered this in a video. It's another deadly mantis and I'll pop the description and scientific name there because I'm not going to try it if you saw my last video. So what we'll do is we'll get the camera out in a bit and have a little look at these on the macro lenses. And we've also got another special guest too. And here's the special guest, my granddaughter. So my son's a proud daddy. And she was born the other week. I think it was last Saturday, was it? <laughs> Let's put another shrimp on the barbie. Let's not. Well, this Saturday just gone home Monday, so I see it went wrong. And she's crying. And this is Primrose. And she's crying. And, and she's just got a trump as well. <laughs> So I'm just going to pass her back to Grandma because she loves being called Grandma <laughs> she's giving me dirty leaves now. There we go, Grandma. Hiya folks, so we're back after them shots and we'll go over some care needs for these. So, what do you keep your mantis at? 26 degree, degrees Celsius. <laughs> He's trying to get weirds out, see, must yeah. run in the family with it. Uh, and okay, so in spraying wise, how many times you spray it? Every other day. Yeah, so let's go through some more care needs in Pacific. So I do believe these myself are best kept between around 25 to 30 degrees Celsius. I have seen some websites claiming that they can go up to 35. I don't personally know that myself, but it's something I wouldn't do. Now temperature wise dropping at night, I wouldn't let them drop below 22 in my opinion. And humidity they like it 50 to 80 percent. Now these can be drawn clean sometimes, I've never had one myself for them to do it, but they can act like they're dead, so they freeze, drop to the ground, don't worry, they may not be dead in all cases, so don't throw them in the bin, please, because I have seen some horror stories of people doing that. And enclosure wise, always make sure you've got good cross ventilation in there, like with any other mantis species, and they are really good, I mean this one's just prior to the video, it's just at a nice green bottle at the size it's at, so they will take the price, so don't worry about that. Any case, folks, if you've liked the video, give us a like. Please give it a like. It helps move it up in the algorithms and YouTube. So give us a like. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell down below to keep you up to date with the next videos coming. And the next video we are going to be doing is the spiny flower mantis because Linda has got the addiction now. This is how it starts. You have one, two, three, four, then you end up with fourteen. Your house is full of mantises. So we will be doing a video on that, but at the moment we think it's um, going to molt, so we've left it. So any case, thanks for watching, guys. Catch you in the next one. Bye.